Hey everyone, in this video we will discuss the full outer join. Um, so this is a mer merge query option. So when you've got two tables and you merge them and you use the full outer join, what happens? So I'll just try to explain this to you before we do the actual uh, example. So I've got two tables. One is the customer table and the location table. So you can see the customer, there's customer ID, customer name and location ID. And then location table has location ID and location name. So in a way, if I join these two tables on location ID, which is the common field, I should get the corresponding. So I should get the customer ID, customer name and location name, for example. So if I do a full outer join, what happens? So uh, let's say for the first record, one Tintin and then he sits in Belgium. So the whole record comes through. Similarly, for the second record, this whole record comes through. Same for the third one, same for the fourth one. But let's go, the fifth one doesn't exist in the location table. So location for Bob is five, that location ID doesn't exist in um, the location table. So when you use a full outer join, what happens is that this record still persists in the result set, but the corresponding location name and location ID from the location table are null, which makes sense because there is no corresponding value there. And then six, because there is a corresponding location ID, it, it is a wholesome full record. And then for the seventh one, you can see now there is a record in the location table, but there is no corresponding record in the customer table. So it shows the record in the location table, but the corresponding customer record is null. So in a way, it gets all the records from the customer table and it gets all the records from um, the location table, wherever it finds corresponding matching records, it populates the whole result set where it doesn't, it uh, replaces the uh, the values with the null value. So in a way, if you use a full outer join, you get all the rows in the first table as well as all the rows in the second table and wherever the, the, the values do not match, the values for that table will be replaced with null. So that's pretty much it. I'll escape out of this and we'll quickly go to Power BI. Uh, so, so I've got Power Query Editor open here with me and you can see there are two table customer and location. So we'll just open this. And they're depictive of what I showed you. So there are like one, two, three, four, five, and six. And then there is location. But in location, there's no a fifth location ID for five, and there's an extra row for a location ID seven. So let's just select any of the table, it doesn't matter because what we'll do is, so I'm in Power Query Editor on the Home tab. I go to Merge Queries, and I hit Merge Queries, but I select Merge Queries as new. And then we'll just join the two tables. So I'll, I'll select the other table as the location table and I'll say, hey, join it on the basis of the location ID. And then I have to define the join kind. And for the join kind is where I will select the full outer and I will hit OK. So it's defined it. I'll just call this full outer join for now. And you can see here that for uh, Location ID 5, sorry, for customer ID 5, there's no corresponding, let me just, uh, sorry, break it open. So you can see for customer ID 5, the location ID and location name are null, as we were discussing that, because the location ID 5 doesn't exist in the location table. And similarly for location ID 7, doesn't exist in the, co no corresponding record exists in the customer table, so these values are null. So uh, just wanted to take you through the full outer join. There might be scenarios where you want to capture all the records and not filter any records based on the join criterion. So in that case, you would you would probably go with a full outer join. So I hope you find this video useful. And thanks for watching this video. Uh, please do subscribe to my channel and like my videos if you enjoy what I'm doing. Uh, let me know if you would like me to take any specific topics. Cheers, bye.